guys, what's up? It's Sammy. I just wanted to jump on here and say that this video is going to be me making over my apartment slash house. It's technically a house, but it's like a one bedroom slash studio. So it's kind of like an apartment and I rent it like an apartment. Um, I just wanted to say thank you at the start of this video for watching this video and to remind you to subscribe to my channel. Um, I'm going to be doing a whole series making over my house and this is just part one. Oh well, yeah, without further ado, let's go back to Sammy of three days ago who did not know nearly quite how much work she had ahead of her. Okay, bye. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? It's Sammy and welcome to day one of my home renovation vlog. This has been a long time coming. We're painting the ceilings. As you can see up there, my ceilings are a lovely shade of baby poop brown. And also I never finished painting my walls when I moved in here two years ago because I have ADHD. Anytime I vlog, I'm always afraid to show the ceilings and like the top of my apartment because it's just not painted good. Literally that is what I've been living with for two and a half years. My mom is coming down from Northern Arizona and we are going to be repainting my entire apartment as well as giving my room like a major, major makeover. So before I even do anything, I want to get some before shots of my apartment. So here is the cute before montage, I guess. Sorry if it's a little bit loud. I have the AC going behind me, the window AC, because it's going to get hot with us like literally moving every single piece of furniture out of my house today. So pardon that. <laughs> I'm just trying to cool it down a little bit before my mom gets here because like I said, she's coming down from Northern Arizona. So she's used to it being like 50 degrees and it's 80 degrees outside. But yeah, I've been super embarrassed about filming anything in my house for the longest time because I thought that it just looked so bad. I was always super conscious of like the angles in which I filmed that and stuff because I didn't want you guys to see like the fact that there's just random paint on my ceiling but that all ends today I'm hoping that this whole room house makeover makes me a little bit more comfortable in vlogging and stuff like that but yeah I guess I will update you when I'm picking out paint colors at Home Depot oh wait let me show you the paint colors for my bed this is like the color that this wall is right now I really only painted it this dark green color because I was in a bit of like a time crunch and this wall was dark blue so the only thing that could really cover it fast was dark green. But as you can see it makes this room like really dark. Like I would never film in here because this room is really dark. This room is also really, really, really small. <laughs> I don't show you guys this because I think this room looks like a crack den, like I think it looks Horrible. Basically, what we are going to be doing in this room is a faux wainscoting. Um, and the top part of the room is going to be white, and the bottom part of the room is going to be light French gray. Think about it something like this. As you can see, the walls right now aren't even white. <laughs> They're like a sort of beigey white color. So this whole room is going to be just so much lighter and brighter. Now you're probably asking yourself, Sammy, I thought you were renting the place. I am renting this place. So why am I doing all these renovations? Well, number one, I started renting this place before everything in my city started to skyrocket in price. If you guys have ever lived in Los Angeles, you will know that like the cost of living there like rent wise is like super high, like stupid high. And my town of Tucson, Arizona is starting to get to LA prices. It is literally skyrocketing. You can't rent a studio apartment for less than $1,200 in my area of town where I live, which is near the university. Obviously university, it's like the area where everyone my age wants to live. This current place, which is a standalone house. It's not an apartment. It's not a condo. It's not a duplex. It's a house. It is $525 a month rent. I have a super chill landlord. He lets me pretty much do whatever I want. Exhibit A. 
day. I painted a rainbow on my wall like two years ago. But this place is rather run down. It was built in the 1950s. Everything about it is sort of falling apart. So instead of moving into an apartment where I would have to pay $1,200 a month rent, I am choosing to renovate the current place I'm living in and just make it better for the next tenant who moves in. I literally installed these floors two years ago when I moved in. They're a little messy right now because I was sanding the walls um, in preparation for paint. But yeah, I've already put so much money into this place that instead of moving and paying more rent, I'm choosing to just put a couple hundred dollars into it now and stay here for like the next year or two. Even though this place is super small, it is only 400 square feet. $500 for 400 square feet where I live is a steal, a literal steal. Plus water is included. I only have to pay electric, gas, and internet. So like max, I'm paying like $800 a month to live here. So if you're wondering like why I'm doing all of this to a rental unit, it's one for my mental health because I cannot live in a place that I think is ugly or dirty. And this place has been perpetually dirty since I moved in because it hasn't been renovated, renovated since like the early 90s. It's basically gonna save me money to stay here and renovate it, even though it's not my forever home, than it is to move into a new build rental that would be super expensive. Also, I'm selling this mirror on Facebook Marketplace. Goodbye mirror. Um, but yes, now I will update you once we're actually doing something because my mom is currently an hour and a half away on her road trip here. <laughs> oh my God, there's a haboob warning. So it's like super windy out. I'm gonna start my car, it's really hot. Yeah, mom just texted me to go meet her at Home Depot. So I'm about to go to Home Depot. I prefer Lowe's, but mom prefers Home Depot. So we're listening to her because she's the one who's doing all the work. I'm just supervising. <laughs> Okay, so that was absolutely the most stressful experience of my life. I absolutely hate Home Depot. I got a couple clips on my Instagram story of me in there, but like literally could not film. But I have everything literally in the back of my truck. You can see it back there. I got the wood and everything for the faux board and batten. So now I'm gonna go home. I just got out of the shower. I already have my pajamas on. My mom and Kristen just left. Kristen is my friend who also came over to help us. As you can see, we are not done. There's literally a giant part on the wall behind me that's not painted, but the first ceiling is completely done. It is getting a second coat tomorrow, but for the most part, this is what it's going to look like. You can see it's a little different of a color than the wall. Um, it just needs a second coat. I look so ugly because I'm literally exhausted, but my mom bought me food from my favorite vegan restaurant. Not really my favorite, but but it's the only vegan restaurant in my town, so it has to be my favorite. <laughs> but yeah, now I'm gonna go and I'm gonna watch The Sim Supply play <laughs> City Skylines and go to bed because I am literally exhausted. Literally, I'm so tired. Can you see that my mom got paint on my blinds? I'm gonna have to get new blinds. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow for day two. Good morning guys and welcome to day two of renovating. I did not sleep well in this room. It just, all my stuff being all over the place and the smell of paint, like I just did not sleep good. Probably got like two hours of sleep, um, but we are pushing on. I actually have to get dressed because since my little sister is in town, from the White Mountains, AKA literally the smallest town in Arizona, the only store they have is a JCPenney's. Um, we're going shopping. How do I put blueberry on the app? Oh, she's giving me Duncan. It's under the unsweetened flavor. Sorry, I like blueberry in my matcha latte and she couldn't figure out how to do that. <laughs> they don't have a Duncan up there either. I'm taking her shopping with my dad at that outlet mall so she can go to like Nike, Adidas, Vans, Forever 21 and get like all of her shopping done for the whole year. <laughs> while she's here because like literally they only have Ross and JCPenney and Goodwill up there. And my sister's not a big thrifting fan. Like she was when we were younger when we had to do it, but now that like we have a little bit more money, she's just not into it, which I like, I totally get. Sometimes you just want nice new things. Yeah, that's what I'm doing today. I'm gonna help my mom until about like one o'clock and then I'm gonna start like getting ready. And then we're gonna go to the outlet mall, which is about like 45 minutes away from my house. So it's gonna be a little bit of adventure. Um, waking up to this though, even though I didn't get much sleep was 
fantastic. Um, another thing on the agenda though that's been added, I have to go to Home Depot and get a new vent cover because um, true landlord fashion, that one is the wrong size and doesn't actually fit in the vent and it's nailed to my door frame. <laughs> So I gotta go to Home Depot. I think I, that's a 12 by 12 and I need a 10 by 10. It's like $7. So um, you're welcome, my landlord. Honestly, you're welcome, my landlord, for this whole project, but specifically for that because that's kind of dangerous. I'm so excited to finish the room today. We're actually planning on finishing the whole house today, guys. The entire house has to be painted today because my mom leaves tomorrow and she can't leave me to paint. She can't leave me to paint. I'll never finish. <laughs> absolutely freezing in my house but you kind of see that we finished the bedroom <laughs> you're probably wondering uh you didn't vlog much yesterday no i got a concussion oh uh, can you see i don't know if the, i feel like it might be too bright in here for you to see the huge bruise and jo okay yeah do you see where it's like yellow and it's like really swollen yeah uh, I didn't really do all that much yesterday. My mom ended up doing it and I just completely forgot about vlogging because my camera was in my car. But yeah, we finished painting the whole house. Um, so the hardest part is done. I'll have to show you the absolute... Oh, Booty just woke up. I just woke up. So that makes sense. He's like, who are you talking to? And I'm like, I'm definitely talking to myself. Instagram saw it first. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, go check it out. Um, but yeah, it's like so bright and beautiful in here. And I do see that my camera battery is dying. So I'm gonna let it charge while I like get breakfast and stuff. My mom's coming over before she heads back uh, to Northern Arizona because she's leaving. So everything else I have to do by myself. And that is very terrifying. I have to finish. Ooh, I'm so tired. It's seven in the morning right now. I have to finish painting the Faux Wayne scotting the board and batten all by myself. And I'm a messy painter. <laughs> How do I turn this thing off? Okay, I made myself some hummus toast and some avocado toast to power through the day. Well, that's all I've done. I haven't charged my camera. I just got out of bed to make this. I took Booty outside and I fed him. This is realistic. This is a very realistic home makeover vlog. The avocado was rancid on that toast. I know there were some brown spots and I cut them off and I thought it would be fine. Um, no. Nope, not fine. Concussion check. Ooh. Oh, it's like I have Botox. It's like I can't raise my eyebrow. Oh my God. I got that from being punched in the face, by the way. I'm about to de-landlordify this, <laughs> this thing. Three, two, one. Okay, that's it, bye. Good morning. Oh wait, I'm not wearing my hat I wanted to wear. Hold on, main character, that's me. Anyways, I've done a lot of vlogging on my Instagram story and not on my camera because it was dead. I don't even remember what the last thing I told you about was, but to finish off this home makeover vlog, I wanted to show you a finished product, a semi-finished product, um, which is my bedroom. I can't finish the rest of the house in time, but I will do a part two. I don't know when that will be up, but I will do a part two. Um, so without further ado, here is my finished bedroom. <laughs>
three days, a concussion, some blood, sweat, and believe it or not, many tears that I did not capture on camera. My room is finally done. My living room, however, is not. <laughs> This brings me to the end of this video, but be sure to subscribe if you wanna see part two, where I finish my living room and my office and my kitchen, which will all probably be in one part. But yeah, this is my room. Uh, it's all beautiful. I love it. But yeah, that is it for this video, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked this video, please really like clicking the thumbs up, and you wish to subscribe already, and you had not yet, click the bell below to turn on notifications so you're no phone question. Actually, enjoy my content, join the party. So thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Fwaaaap.